visit us on onestepenglish.com. Business English. More idioms. Let's learn English. Today, we will learn some more idioms that are usually used in an office setting. We will also give some examples, so you will understand each idiom. Tie up some loose ends. It means to finish things completely. Tie up some loose ends. Here's an example. I'm working late today because I want to tie up some loose ends for the weekend. That's a good idea, but take some rest as well. At loggerheads, it means in stubborn dispute or disagreement. At loggerheads. Here's an example. No progress has been made because the managers are at loggerheads over the best way to continue the project. How long do we need to wait? We're running out of time. Cover all the bases. It means to deal with every aspect of the situation. Cover all the bases. Here's an example. Please do your research carefully. We need to cover all the bases to make sure we don't violate any laws. Yes, madam. We're working on it. Blue collar workers. It refers to a worker who does manual labor. Blue collar workers. Here's an example. The decrease in manufacturing means there are fewer jobs available for blue collar workers. I know, but we really have to lessen manufacturing right now. Pass the buck. It means to pass responsibility to someone. Pass the buck. Here's an example. When a flaw was discovered in the building plans, the project supervisor tried to pass the buck to the engineers. But it's already settled, right? It's a safe bet. It means it's certain to happen or extremely likely to be true. It's a safe bet. Here's an example. The company is having financial problems. It's a safe bet that some of the staff will be let go. That's what always happens. It's not final, and you still need to have a meeting about it, right? Cash cow. It refers to a very profitable product or service. Cash cow. Here's an example. Although our customers occasionally buy clothing, jewelry is the real cash cow. I agree, I think we have to release a new collection. Under the gun. 
It means something or someone is under a lot of pressure. Under the gun. Here's an example. I'm really under the gun right now. I have five projects due in three days. I wish I could help you, but I gotta go now. It's my mom's birthday. Ballpark figure. It refers to a rough numerical estimate or approximation. Ballpark figure. Here's an example. How much did our expenses increase last month? No need to look it up, just give me a ballpark figure. The expenses were actually decreased by 5%. Let's practice your English. Ready your pen and paper, then try to answer the exercise. Choose the correct answer. I'm working late today because I want to. Before the weekend. Letter A. Tie up some loose ends. Letter B. Blue collar workers. Letter C. Ballpark figure. The correct answer is. Letter A. Tie up some loose ends. I'm working late today because I want to tie up some loose ends before the weekend. No progress has been made because the managers are over the best way to continue the project. Letter A. It's a safe bet. Letter B. At loggerheads. Letter C. Pass the buck. The correct answer is. Letter B. At loggerheads. No progress has been made because the managers are at loggerheads over the best way to continue the project. Please do your research carefully. We need to. To make sure we don't violate any laws. Letter A. Cash cow. Letter B. Under the gun. Letter C. Cover all the bases. The correct answer is. Letter C. Cover all the bases. Please do your research carefully. We need to cover all the bases to make sure we don't violate any laws. The decrease in manufacturing means there are fewer jobs available for. Letter A. Blue collar workers. Letter B. Ballpark figure. Letter C. It's a safe bet. The correct answer is. Letter A. Blue collar workers. The decrease in manufacturing means there are fewer jobs available for blue collar workers. When a flaw was discovered in the building plans, the project supervisor tried to, to the engineers. Letter A. Under the gun. Letter B. Pass the buck. 
Letter C. At loggerheads. The correct answer is. Letter B. Pass the buck. When a flaw was discovered in the building plans, the project supervisor tried to pass the buck to the engineers. The company is having financial problems. That some of the staff will be let go, that's what always happens. Letter A. Cover all the bases. Letter B. Blue collar workers. Letter C. It's a safe bet. The correct answer is. Letter C. It's a safe bet. The company is having financial problems. It's a safe bet that some of the staff will be let go, that's what always happens. Although our customers occasionally buy clothing, jewelry is the real. Letter A. Cash cow. Letter B tie up some loose ends. Letter C. It's a safe bet. The correct answer is. Letter A. Cash cow. Although our customers occasionally buy clothing, jewelry is the real cash cow. I'm really, right now, I have five projects due in three days. Letter A, at loggerheads. Letter B, under the gun. Letter C, pass the buck. The correct answer is, letter B, under the gun. I'm really under the gun right now. I have five projects due in three days. How much did our expenses increase last month? No need to look it up, just give me A. Letter A. Blue collar workers. Letter B. Cover all the bases. Letter C. Ballpark figure. The correct answer is. Letter C. Ballpark figure. How much did our expenses increase last month? No need to look it up, just give me a ballpark figure. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to click like and subscribe. Visit us on onesteppenglish.com.